Hey, boys and girls, it's Miss Freitas time. Nice to see you. Hey, I got a haircut. During quarantine, isn't that incredible? <laughs> All right, well, I'm so glad you're back. May the 4th be with you. Uh, it's a big Star Wars type of day for anyone who loves Star Wars. Uh, and I don't have a Star Wars book, but I know it'll be a fun book to read on the 4th. Tomorrow is my daughter's birthday, and I just want to wish her happy birthday early. And I'll probably wish her happy birthday tomorrow, too. All right, so, meatloaf, monster from the school cafeteria. This is by Mike Thaler and illustrated by Jared Lee. And it is testable. It is a 2.7 book level. <clears throat> it was lunchtime. Our class walked slowly toward the cafeteria holding our noses. We could smell the food all the way down the hall. It was also making funny noises. We opened the cafeteria door. <laughs> We took our trays and were about to line up when we backed away from the lunch counter in horror. The meatloaf was moving. It wiggled and jiggled in the pan. Ew, it's moving. <laughs> then it slurped out the pan, slid off the counter, and slithered across the cafeteria floor. It was coming for us! We threw our lunch trays in the air and ran out the door! Can you guys pretend you're running? <laughs> so much fun. Mrs. Crum, the cook, ran out of the cafeteria shouting at the meatloaf. She tried to hit it with a serving spoon. The loaf blurped over her shoes and she was gone! Oh my goodness. This is cray cray. We ran into the main office. Call the sheriff, we all shouted. Now what's wrong, said Miss Bagley, the principal. She smiled. The meat law is after us, we screamed. Now, now, smiled Mrs. Oh, no, no. She says, now, now, smiled Mrs. Bagley, opening the office door and stepping out. There's absolutely nothing to blurp. She never finished her sentence. She just disappeared into the blurbing loaf. Oh, my goodness. She got blurbed. We ran into her office and locked the door. Through the glass, we could see the meatloaf eating all the safety posters. We, didn't, we dialed the sheriff soon. We heard his siren. He burst in, took out his badge, and told the loaf, not to move. The food moved, then chased the sheriff all the way out of the school. Uh-oh. Look, this is not looking good. <laughs> oh, no. We dialed the fire department. A big red engine roared up. The meatloaf was e eating the flagpole. The fireman unrolled a huge hose and squirted the loaf with water. The meatloaf splashed merrily and took a bath. A little funny, huh? Meatloaf taking a bath. He dialed the army. We did. A jeep pulled up. Four soldiers jumped out of the f f jumped out with flamethrowers. They turned the flame on the food. The meatloaf warmed up. It burbled over their boots. And they were all eaten by a hot lunch. We dialed the Air Force. Soon, two jet planes roared overhead. <laughs> Here they come. Dun, dun, dun. Call in the reinforcements. They each dropped a bomb on the food, but the meatloaf just burped. Then... It ate the jungle gym, the slides, and all of our swings. We all screamed. Ah! Can you give me a scream? Ah! 
loud, but not too loud. Don't bother your parents. <laughs> then we thought of Mickey. Mickey is the only one who can save us. Mickey will eat anything. We found Mickey licking the snack machine. He told We told him what had happened. He smiled. We walked calmly to the center of the playground. He sat down in front of the food and took out two spoons. The meatloaf gurgled. Out came Miss Crumb. The meatloaf blurbed. Out came Miss Bagley. The meatloaf blurbed and out flew safety posters and the soldiers. <laughs> the meatloaf looked at Mickey. Mickey looked at the meatloaf. It burbled and glurped and slithered toward him. Closer. 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 <laughs> Not too bad for a visual, huh? He ate it. He ate it all. He ate it all up. Then he licked his spoons, twirled them, and put them back in his pockets and asked for seconds. We all cheered. The mayor came. Yay. Way to go, Mickey. He gave Mickey a bright medal for saving the school. Mickey looked at the medal, smiled. What do you think he's going to do? Think he'll wear it? And ate it. <laughs> so he's almost as crazy as the meatloaf, huh? All right. What do you love about a book like this? Is this fiction or nonfiction? This is fiction. Would your meatloaf really jump out of the cafeteria and run after you? <laughs> I hope not. And... Can Mickey eat everything? And can Meatloaf gobble up the principal and the teacher and the cafeteria lady? <laughs> no. <laughs> but it sure is fun to have fun with a good book. I thought that was a cute one. And it is testable. So I'll make sure I tell you the number. I can tell you it now. 156-498. 156-498. Hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for reading with me. Remember, we are still in this together. Keep working hard, boys and girls. Keep trying your very best at home. Challenge yourself to learn something new every day. Just be the best kiddo you can be, okay? All right, I'm going to go, but I look forward to seeing you again real soon. Bye, guys. Have a great day. Be safe. Wash your hands a lot. Bye.